Oh, yeah, no. I, here's the thing. They came in as two strays. They're both about a year old, and we didn't know anything about them. You know, they're... So how do they look at Well, they've, made, they've been able to keep them apart from half the time they were with Kathy. So, so she's like, on. I'll take you both on. No, oh, it's probably not a good idea, because you're probably not going to win that. So they've been able to keep them separated right now, but this is, I, I don't... This is, our cat knows how to get out of rooms. There's times they're like, how did the doors stay closed? Uh, <laughs> how did the dog get out of the bedroom? So they're never in that cat. Yeah. And it's okay. I mean, we, now we know they probably shouldn't be around cats. Yep. Um, and, and that they're rum, rambunctious. I mean, they were really mellow here. They were really calm. I didn't feel like this for a minute. They were still a little shell shocked. They only been in home to the shelter for a couple days. So, you know, having done this for so long as they have, you kind of have to look at, you got to find the positive in them. You know, and yeah. so now we know a few more things yeah. that we didn't know yesterday. So, so when they're bringing back, if they are available? Yeah, if they're available, I'll bring them back up. Yeah. But now, and I would prefer to bring them back up here because now I know yeah. and I can make sure that <coughs> if they can come back Whoever up here, then I can make sure yeah. they're going that it's going to work. Yeah. Yeah. But he said, despite taking them outside multiple times, they have like an action lesson. I'm like, okay, that's their kind of thing. Yeah. 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 Last training that they don't want to bring back. So, so I said, just play up the angle when you talk to the shelter that you're concerned about the safety of the cat and bring back next year. So, and then at the end of the day, if they're not willing to take them up, then you just leave them wondering. Yeah, they they're, right. they're, right. they're, they're like, you, it's like you just took two toddlers home. Like, you yeah. don't have some work to do. So, yeah. You know. And it's okay. I mean, like I said, we, we now know a little bit more. Oh, hey. You know. Oh, that's fun. Girl. Girl. <laughs> so she you don't look like a fall, though. <laughs> she's not able to. She's a gem. Like, she she like that. Like, she, you know, I won't bring it back, not after that. That was totally unprovoked, and it was way over the top. For what it's Yeah. Like. I mean, for, for what it was. No, this is her first day up here. So, well, and the thing is, it won't be her first day again. So, um, I don't know what I want to do. That's not me. Being here for one day and getting 
being closed for three days and then coming back on Thursday, I know that I want to deal with starting at square one again. Um, and yet she's like, so the couple of them that are here on Thursday, Well, and here's the problem. If she's doing it here, there's a very strong possibility that coming in contact with the dog out here, she can do that. Do you have to call me? So, yeah. Or are you so, just trying to... Just so you know, when that gentleman and I... The, that dog and I... Mm -hmm. Right. What's your name? Aragon. 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 Yeah. That dog. That, 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 that one right this, there. This, this one here? Yeah, that one. That, 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 one, that one right yeah. there. Okay. We just took him right down to the gravel, and I gave him the leash. Right. So he could pull on to it and stuff. And then some guy had come up and he had a black lab and he said, Is that, are you guys from the rescue up there yet? Are you walking that dog yet? Is that dog available yet? Before I knew it, the dogs were doing an intro. So, anyway. How, how was he though? Was he okay? He was absolutely fine. Oh, cool. Their that, dog. That must have been what did it for him. Because when he came back, he says to me, he says, I, I'm going to go home and get her and, and bring her He back. wanted to play. Their dog oh. was absolutely fine. He was letting him smell it. Yeah. And then he was getting, getting down and like just jumping play and working yeah. and like running play around. around. It was so cute. But I thought, like, the only thing is that his dog is old. She's like, I think he said she's like 13 or 14. Mm -hmm. So she might not want to deal Seems, with his puppy yeah. energy. But that's good to know that he might be okay. Yeah. So, so what him. made him decide that that was cool and he was going to um, I think that's probably what it was. Just like seeing how he interacted. Because he was telling me, he's like, Oh, you know, I don't like to make you know quick decisions. Yeah. I'm one of those. I'm an overthinker that. and blah blah blah. And I said, "See, I said I understand that, but just understand he's young." And I didn't even ask the part about him being in the. He was in a in, in an area because he was in the multi purpose room since he got the pack. He was in lockdown. Nobody saw him, so nobody was going through the kennels. Now when he goes back, he'll be in the kennels. Oh yeah. So there's no way he won't. Yeah. Uh, tomorrow, maybe Tuesday at the most. So then he stopped. So I had that conversation with him, yeah. and then you guys went out for the walk. And I think that's what did it. And then he found out that he was right. Somebody else was interested in that. That other guy, um, his dog was a, a black guy. Oh, he was yeah. calm. Very, he was very calm. I think I saw that. And time. they got along. They did. And the guy with the oh, black lab, he, he called his girlfriend over and he said, like, Honey, come see this dog. And we're like, Is this a third dog? And he says, Yeah, we are. So I kind of thought they were going to be involved. Exactly. Like they didn't come up. And they wanted to know more about him. And I'm like, You know, if you come here, I'm going to put you in on some stuff. But he's the one that walked up to us. Yeah, I know. Right. See? And that surprised me, too. I mean, how many people out there with their dog come up to you with the rescue dog when you walk up to the rescue dog? Don't you? You just don't do that. That's not healthy. But people don't get that. I know. Like, there's dog etiquette, you know?